Hey guys, what's up? It's Jasar here, and I have a public service announcement I would like to make. RuneScape is not a dating site. Now, I know this may come as a shock to many of you, considering the number of e-daters that you may find in your local Profidness Grand Exchange, or even at the Grand Exchange in Varrock, wearing these weird little outfits and some of the new cosmetic items that were given with the Valentine's Day event. Let me just go ahead and say first off, I am not opposed to online dating. I myself have found numerous women through online dating websites, and I have met a number of these women in person. However, there is a time and place for you to, you know, go about your personal lives. RuneScape is not one of those places. RuneScape is an MMORPG, and I understand most players like to engage in an e-dating scenario through the role-playing game element of RuneScape. However, that is not what the game is meant for. Now, let me go ahead and say that let's say you actually do um, find a girl on RuneScape and you start talking to her on Skype and everything like that. Once you transition from RuneScape to Skype, that's where you need to keep that. Because now it is in private. You don't have to go running around in-game dressing up in these little outfits and you know telling each other how much you love each other in-game. You have a voice communication for that and it's kind of disrupting the gameplay for other players. Because when I run into the GE, and I see e-daters spouting off random shit to their e-date companion, it kind of sickens me, and it kind of bothers me. It makes me uncomfortable. Because when I get on RuneScape, I do it to basically kind of escape from reality. I mean, if I want to meet somebody, I can do it in my personal time. I can go online to a website, I can start talking to a girl, I can find, you know, a girl that's into the same shit that I am. And that's where it comes in again. Let me repeat, RuneScape is not a dating site. There is a time and a place for your online dating needs. eHarmony's not crowded. Blackpeoplemeet.com is, uh, is an obvious choice. Hell, FarmersOnly.com's a thing if that's what you're into. But seriously, it's a game, it's a game. Stop bringing your eat date bullshit onto the game. Again, if you want to meet somebody online, numerous websites for that. Pretty sure if you run a Google search, you can find somebody online that you can talk to about whatever the hell it is you want. And again, like I said, I understand. Some people take that RPG element seriously. Now, the main reason why I'm telling you guys this isn't to hurt your feelings. I understand there are l numerous people that have actually found somebody online through RuneScape, and they're actually, you know, boyfriend and girlfriend now, and that's cool. But the point is, when you log into this game, and you just randomly start talking to this person, for one, you don't even know if it's an actual girl. That's the screwed up part, and that's the sick part behind this. Because, even though you could be a guy in real life, you could easily make your character into a girl and fake being a girl to get pretty much anything you want. Now, I've actually had a friend that he did through RuneScape once before. Not only did he lose money in-game, but he was also pretty much scammed for $1,500 IRL money. And this is where it becomes a problem. This is why it's not safe to do this kind of crap. Because eventually it's going to get to that point where you're going to start trusting this person. And then eventually you're going to slip up. And you're going to let them know, hey, this is uh, my RuneScape password. This is my login name. You know, I'm trusting you to go on this. Can you do something for me? The next thing you know, you've lost your shit. Now, I'm not saying all the people that you talk to on RuneScape are going to do that. But I'm just saying, this is why RuneScape isn't a dating site. The number one thing you can take away from this, online dating is one thing. Online dating through an RPG made purely for entertainment is another thing. Seriously, if you want to e-date, don't do it online. Well, I mean, don't do it in-game. Online is fine, 
Just don't do it in a video game. I mean, have some common sense. I mean... I actually like women IRL. I mean, if pixels do it for you, then... You know, I mean, there, there's a whole nother realm of, like, websites you can look into for that. It's not exactly kit-friendly, but, I mean, you know, if that's that's your kind of thing, I mean, you know, kind of go over that way. But seriously. The e-dating shit gets annoying. And I've seen a lot of people end up, you know, going fucking crazy because their e-date decided to find somebody else. And I mean, I understand how that shit can fuck you up IRL, but it's over a video game. Seriously. Again, I know this is a controversial topic, I'm probably going to get a lot of hate on this, but let me know in the comments section below what you guys think of e-dating on RuneScape. And, you know, just leave me your honest feedback below. Click the like button if you, ha um, you know, agreed with anything that I've said. Hit the dislike button if you disliked it you know, subscribe for more videos, and there will be streams starting next week, I'm not going to be streaming this weekend due to double XP, so good luck on double XP everybody, get them gains, and I will talk to you guys later. Again, this has been Rage of Sorrow, teaching you to work smarter, not harder, and always be safe online, you never know who or what you might be talking to. Some food for thought, peace out.